road is about to widen to decongest the current traffic conditions. For the past few months, the city of Virginia Beach has been demolishing rundown houses along the corridor, causing people like Ron Hamilton, who's been living here for 20 years, to move out. Well, I have to be out by the end of March. One, another month, say. Another month, yeah. I want to stay in the area. I want to stay in this area. The city has worked real, real close with them and in, in giving them a, um, a fair price and to relocate them. But of course, relocating anybody from a home that they've been in, you know, 29, 30 years is difficult because you can't put a price on sentimental value of being on that property when your kids are born. So it's not like that we went out one day and started knocking on doors telling people they were going to have to move. Uh, we probably had as much as a four-year public uh, involvement process uh, in this project. Costs for this project, which has already begun, have been costly. This goes for the demolition of houses, churches, and a medical building at the intersection of Greenwich and Witch Duck Roads. The costs also go for tearing up the sidewalks and roads that currently exist. The current price tag for building this, this project is $26 million. You know, you can't argue with the fact that some improvements are, are things that have to be done somebody's going to suffer. Part of any road widening project, you're going to impact businesses, you're going to impact people's homes. The roadway was badly needed and it should have been widened probably 20 plus years ago. Traffic conditions on Witch Duck Road will be snarled for a while, but once the expansion is complete, rush hour and regular traffic will run much more smoothly. This is Kristen Smith reporting.